to my channel so in today's video I am going to be doing as you can see from the title a self tanning routine I have one of these up on my channel already when I was using the loving tan so I will post my little picture here of when I used loving tan which was one of my favorite tanners until you know when you're on YouTube you see different influencers using different products and you want to try them out so I'm gonna get into the product that I have been using for a little over a year now and then I'll get into what I'm using now in a little review so when you saw this picture right here I was using loving tan I loved it I loved the color that it gave me and it was great at the time then I saw you know other youtubers using the Bondi sands which is right here and you know this is a great self tanner too it's affordable it gets the job done it tans you up um, is it one of my favorites no but have I been using it for over a year because this is what I had sitting in my closet absolutely so this is the Bondi sands the Australian tan arrow it is a self tanning foam in the color ultra dark it's a quick dry formula intense hydration and coconut scent um, do I think it's really hydrating? It's not super hydrating on my skin, but might be on yours. I got this at Walgreens too. So like I said, you can get it right in your local drugstore and it is affordable. Um, the one issue that I do have with this self tanner right here, and I'll show you the comparison of the one that I'm currently using now, which is my all time fave. I do not like the undertone of this color when I put this all over my skin. It has like this green look and I'll put it all over my body and I look like dark green, you know? That's just one thing that I don't like about it. The end result, you get a nice glowing tan, but nothing compares to the self tanner that I'm about to show you right now, okay? Are you guys ready? I think you're ready. All right, so if you guys don't know, I love Ashley Graham. And if you've been following me for a little bit, you know that I did a recreation of one of her makeup looks. Definitely, I think it was more towards the summertime, but if you wanna scroll down, I bet you'll be able to find it and you can see that look. But I love her, and my mom surprised me with this the day before I found out that I had COVID. Yes, we have been so protected for over a year and a half when this all started and somehow it snuck in and got us and now I am fully recovered I'm feeling better than ever but the day before I found out I had COVID and I wasn't feeling good my mom being who she is the best she wanted to give me a gift to make me feel better and it was the Saint Tropez Ashley Graham self tanner and with how much I love Ashley Graham and all like the amazing things that I've been hearing about it, I really wanted it. And she surprised me with it. And I haven't been able to use it. I did use it like a week ago, but I wasn't able to use it during that whole time of having COVID because I didn't want to like get it, you know, infected. So I have had this sitting for the whole time that I was sick. But this is around $55 and the Bondi Sands I believe is around it's no more than 20 bucks. I wouldn't have spent more than 20 bucks on a self tanner going into Walgreens. So that is a big difference in price. But what I gotta say is, first of all, do you not see this packaging? It's just incredible. And as you guys know, or if you're new, if this is your first video, your girl is a sucker for amazing packaging. I live for that. So I will pay for packaging. I didn't pay for this, my mom did. She knows me. But this right here, you only get the self tanner. So if you don't have a mitt at home, you could use a sock. You could use a rubber glove. I've been there, done that, okay? We gotta make what we have work when you need to put your self tanner on. But you can buy mitts at Ulta, but this is what you get when you walk into a Walgreens. You just get the self tanner. With the Ashley Graham St. Tropez, first of all, you get this amazing packaging. We're gonna take this little cover off, toss it over there. You get the sleekest looking self tanner that I've ever seen. Yes, she is Ashley Graham, okay? This is just so sleek, so stunning, I love it. This is their Lux Whipped Cream Mousse, Creme Mousse, how you do it with that little apostrophe? Is it creme, is it cream? I don't know, but this is what it looks like, okay? Okay, not only do you get the self tanner, 
you get the most luxurious mitt that I have ever seen in my entire life, okay? Um, mine has a little bit of animal hair on it, okay? I have a chihuahua where her hair, I don't know how, it just gets everywhere. You know, I don't understand. But this is the mitt right here. It's like a velvet, like it's so soft. And of course it has Ashley Graham St. Tropez on the back with this really pretty like gold looking foil. Just in itself right there. You got your money's worth with the quality of the mitt, the packaging, the way it looks, but with the way this product applies on the skin, the way that it feels right there. If I was just buying this one thing for $55, it would be worth the price. And you're getting a luxurious mitt in nice packaging all for that amount of money. You can't beat that. You can't be that, I'm telling you. So I am going to show you guys how I do my self-tanning routine. I'm going to show you guys on my chest, and then I'm going to apply it on my legs. I'm going to have my mom put it on my back. I put it everywhere because we want to be glowing and tanning. Even though your girl was laying out in the sun today because it was like the first day, which Mother's Day, happy Mother's Day, even though I'm posting this after midnight, you guys know me. Um, happy Mother's Day to all the moms out there. I was laying in the sun for a little bit. I can't resist. I know it's not the best, so that's why I'll lay in the sun for a little bit, but I'll still have my tan from my self-tanner. Um, so I'm going to get into it. The first thing that you guys are going to want to do is you want to make sure that you exfoliate your skin. So if you're taking a shower now, if you already took one earlier, I like to take one a few hours before self-tanning. So I already did that, and plus I filmed a TikTok, so I had to put some makeup on, which was good, so I can come on here fully beat and talk to you guys. But I already did that, and what you wanna do, just a little tip if you have dry skin like me, because dry skin gang, where you at? You wanna come in with a lotion. You wanna lotion up your elbows, your knees, your ankles, your wrists, wherever you have more drier skin, and that's for everybody. Your elbows ain't going to be super super smooth that's a more drier area on the human body you want to put that lotion on as a barrier so when you put the self tanner on it doesn't cling to the skin and leave that orangey dark look on your elbows your knees your ankles your wrists so use this as a barrier and what I like to do what I find gives me the most naturalist tan is I put a thin layer over my whole body my arms my legs my chest my belly my booty I put it everywhere just as that thin little barrier so nothing if I have a dry patch of skin on my arm nothing clings to it we want it to look as natural as can be for a tanner coming in a bottle. So real quick, I wanna show you the difference in color, what I was talking about. And I'm telling you, if you can't go out and get the Ashley Graham for $55, this right here works just as good. You know me, I'm the type of person I could use, which I haven't, maybe one day, I'd use a $300 skin moisturizer, but I also have my favorite moisturizer. I'm looking at it right in front of me and it's from the dollar store. So I am a person that I will try anything from low end to high end. And I'm telling you, if you can't get this Ashley Graham, this one works amazing for what it does. It's a self tanner. It's going to give you a tan no matter what. But if you want to be a little more bougie, the Ashley Graham one, hands down. Okay, you guys. So I got my paper towel right here because I want to show you the difference in color. So I'm going to put the Ashley Graham one on first. I like to give the bottle a nice shake just to get that color in there moving around and whatever they put in there. You don't want nothing to be patchy, girl, okay? Or boy, whoever self tan in, we, we need that tan. So I'm going to do the Ashley Graham and just the color is so pretty. Oh my God, it's literally like that perfect, like bronzy caramel, mm-hmm, love it. Now the Bondi Sands, like I said, it's good, but the color throws me off a little bit. All right, so I kind of dragged the product out just so you can see. All right, so remember, the Bondi Sands is also in the color Ultra Dark. What is the Ashley Grand, does it say? It just says Luxe Whipped creme mousse cream mousse it doesn't say a color so this right here is the ashley graham literally perfection that color like oh my god you can see what that would give on the skin um you guys can just see the difference in color right there 
Is it a bad thing? No. When you wash that first layer off the next day or the few hours later, it comes off. But just the color in itself always threw me off a little bit, and especially when I rubbed it on my body, I just didn't like seeing that greenish look. When I put the Ashley Graham on for the first time, it instantly looked like your girl was laying on the beach, like looking all nice and golden brown. You know what I mean? So that is just the color comparison right there. Like I said, Bondi Sand still gets the job done. I'm not dissing it at all because I've been using it for over a year. But if you look at the two colors, this would be the one my eyes would gravitate to first. Also, one last thing, the smell of them. So the Bondi Sands, it... It's fine. It smells like coconut. It's definitely not like a really bad smell. The smells don't bother me, but I got it on my nose. OMG. So smells like coconut. It's all right. The Ashley Graham, it has this like really pretty fragrance. It doesn't smell like a self tanner. It just it smells really fresh and it's just the smell is really nice so I'm just gonna say that if you've tried other self tanners you know they kinda have a certain smell to them this one doesn't I'm telling you this one's the game changer you guys because it's not like any other self tanner that I've used and I've used a few in my time and this one like I said top notch so I'm gonna get started I'm gonna put my lotion all over my body and then we will start applying the self tanner so I'm just taking this, oh, this color, it's just perfection. All right, so I'm looking in my mirror behind the camera. Look at how this color already looks on my skin. Like, you guys can't tell me that that don't look good. And then what I also love about this, even though the Bondi Sands says it's hydrating, this one, like I said, compares to nothing else I've tried with self-tanners. This one, you guys can already see how hydrating that is. Do you see right there? Look at the difference. Look how white this shoulder looks and look how like, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. And also, I do not put this on my face. I did see a new product on TikTok that I want to try that's for the face um, that I'm going to get and try. But uh, I don't put this on my face because I just use a darker foundation and I will match it to what my self-tanner does to my skin. You guys just see this? Ugh. I think what gets me with this self-tanner is the color, first of all, but also the hydration. Because I've used a lot of self-tanners and they're not super hydrating that's why I put the lotion on um, so you can rinse it off with as little as an hour let's say you're running out and you let's say you have a date and you just need to do a little bit of self tanner but I keep mine on for a while I'll put on a big baggy sweatshirt some big baggy sweatpants I'll sleep in it and then you know mom life I got things I gotta do and then I'll jump in the shower and my tan is looking phenomenal so I will see you guys tomorrow with the end result. I'm going to put this all over my body the way I just showed you on this arm and my chest. And I will see you guys with the results. Bye. Hey guys, so it's the next morning. I still have my self tanner on. As you guys can see, you can see the difference between my face and my arm. Um, but I just wanted to check in before I hop in the shower. Um, it's almost 12 in the afternoon just because mom life, I've been doing things that I've had to get done. Um, taking care of my son, getting his uh, breakfast and things all ready this morning. And now I feel like I'm going to get myself ready for the day and finish up this video. So I'll see you guys once I put my makeup on and once I wash this first layer of tan off. So I'll see you there. Okay, you guys, so it's later on in the evening when I filmed my little clip of me taking a shower. I did end up taking a shower, but now it is 2.58 Tuesday morning, and now I'm finally having the time to come back on here and show you guys what my tan looks like. You guys can see it's so natural. Like, it's the most naturalist self-tan that I have ever used. A lot of the self-tanners that I've used kind of give you, like, that orangey self tan look and this one literally gives you that natural glowy tan that you get when you're laying out in the sun you're walking on the beach just that sun-kissed beautiful glow like I said it's the most natural tan that I've ever used and it doesn't look orange so I really really love the way that this turned out I hope that you guys did too I really really think that you guys should go and get this product especially with that limited edition mitt 
you need this and just the fact that it's Ashley Graham, the product just in itself is phenomenal. And like I said, being a person that has used self tanners for years, this is the best one yet. And I just love, and you guys can, do you guys see that little bit of shine that it gives my skin? Like it just gives me that beautiful, healthy, glowing look. Now before I go, I am filming this on my TikTok. So if you guys do not follow me on TikTok or you don't have a TikTok, go to your app store, download TikTok, create an account and head over to The Italian Diva 13 because tomorrow, which is today, before I go to bed, I'm putting this on. This is the L'Oreal Paris Sublime Bronze Self Tanning Facial Drops. All you do is you mix your moisturizer, um, for a sun-kissed glow and gradual natural looking tan. So I don't put the Ashley Graham self tanner on my face. Normally I'll just color match a foundation to match, which I think I did pretty good. Um, but I do want to try this product out because it would be nice to go bare face and have my self tanner match my face. Since I wash my face so much, putting self tanner like the Ashley Graham one would just be unnecessary because I'd be washing it off and it would come off a lot quicker. So this one right here, I'm just going to tell you all about it super quick, but make sure you head over to my TikTok, the Italian Diva 13 to see the end result. So it says right here, make sure that your skin is dry clean and exfoliated. You mix five to 10 drops with your moisturizer in the palm of your hand and smooth evenly over face and neck. If you have light colored hair, avoid applying to the eyebrows or hair roots because it will discolor them. Also wash your hands thoroughly after use. That's common sense because you don't want it to stain your hand. And I just did some hand tenna, so you know, that stained my hand. I don't mind if self tanner did, but wash your hands. Let skin dry completely. Avoid washing your face for six to eight hours after application, which will be good because I'll go to sleep, which realistically I might not even get six hours of sleep, so I'll wait an hour after I get up or an hour or two after I get up before I wash my face. And then repeat daily until you love your tan. So I love the fact that you can use this product on a daily basis. Also, it would probably help maintain your tan. Or if you want to get the tan a little bit darker, um, you can keep up with this. But I love the fact that you can do it. I'll probably do this every night just because I do love to self-tan my body. And I am going to be keeping up with the Ashley Graham self-tanner. So I will be trying this out. I got this at CVS and I saw this on TikTok and I was like, I, I got to try it. Quick dry, streak free, transfer proof and for all skin types, it's fragrance free, non-sticky and dye free. So I'm really excited to try this. And what I love the most is that it has hyaluronic acid in it. And that is like one of my favorite skincare products ever. So if you want to see how this product works and my review on it, head over to TikTok, The Italian Diva 13, and give your girl a follow if you want and see how I like this product. So if you guys enjoyed this video, please make sure to give it a big thumbs up. Subscribe if you're not already. If you have tried the Ashley Graham Self Tanner, let me know what you think of it in the comments below. And if you haven't tried the Self Tanner, you have to go get it. I'll see you all in my next video. Bye, guys.